I've loved music all my life, right from the very start. And this is a love of music that really has inspired my life. I love Verdi, I love Italian opera, I love Wagner. My love of opera grew from Carmen. I also love composers of the early 20th century, like a composer relative called Ina Boyle. And that whole area of women composers is something I feel very committed to. The life of a musician is a very difficult one. The work of help musicians has grown. In supporting them, we're supporting the future of music. My name is Katie Rowan, and I'm very pleased and proud to support help musicians. Laura, she is exactly the sort of musician who needs our help and who is benefiting from our help. I'm Laura Fleur, I'm 28 years old and I'm from Worksop. I'm a mezzo-soprano and I'm going to be studying at the National Opera Studio. I was really lucky to go to a free Saturday morning music school and it was a great opportunity to play recorder, do percussion and sing in a choir. From there I grew a huge love for singing and then I joined Kintama's Girls Choir in Mansfield and the conductor Pamela Cook suggested that I look into opera. Not really knowing what opera was at the time, I sought out to watch uh, opera on TV and um, I found Hansel and Gretel and I realised that that's what I have to do. <laughs> I just thought it was an absolute dream to tell stories while sharing music as well and sharing joy. 2020 was actually my year out of studies where I was beginning to get some work. Of course, it was all cancelled because of the pandemic, which was obviously quite gutting for a young singer, quite terrifying. The help musicians were incredible in that time by helping through funding. If I didn't have the help from help musicians, then I would not be able to do this career, quite simply. Donors like Katie, putting a legacy within their will, gives musicians the opportunity to continue their journey through music and the future of music as well. It's been such a joy to meet Katie today, to meet one of the donors and be able to bridge that gap between different generations through music. I feel is really powerful because it is a universal language.